Robin Williams will be getting a special tribute at this year's Emmy Awards. Tonight, reports are his dear friend Billy Crystal will give the tribute during next Monday night's show. And when Robin Williams committed suicide, local singer Sarah Hickman jumped to his defense and outed herself in the process. A lot of emotions there. It turns out this cheerful local star once attempted suicide herself. In tonight's cover story, KITV's Fred Cantu talked with Hickman about her bout with depression and what we can do to help others heading in that direction. This song from Sarah Hickman carries added meaning when you think about Robin Williams' death. When I heard that he'd committed suicide, um, my first reaction was shock, and then my second reaction was, I don't want him to be alone. In a world that feels like a broken home. Hickman can speak to this personally. At the height of her popularity and during a busy South by Southwest weekend, she attempted to kill herself. And as I was sitting there, I felt like such a loser um, watching these three musicians and I started weeping and I got up and I left and I went to a hotel and I attempted to take my life and fortunately my husband and my best friend um, figured out what was going on and that's pretty much all I remember. I know what it means. Hickman later found out a chemical imbalance caused by a dying thyroid had pushed her into a downward spiral. And so that spiral starts happening where all these friends and family members who love you, who would normally support you, you kind of phase them out and you end up at the bottom of this well, being crushed by your depression so that you don't reach out. Broken promises. Hickman says it took medical treatment and rehab to get her back on track, and she's thankful for those who stood by her. The best thing you can really do is say, I've noticed you seem sad. Do you need, need to talk about it? Um, and then just listen. Just let that person pour out their heart. Um, and then keep coming back. And Hickman says always remember, you are not alone. We Fred Cantu, KITV News. Sarah Hickman is honorary chair for the Austin NAMI Walk, benefiting the local chapter of the National Alliance on Mental Illness. It's coming up on September 27th. For details, look for Fred's story on Sarah Hickman on KITV.com.